Happy Holidays from Sweet and Sassy Headquarters. I'm Kristen Rohan, the Sassy SEO and the Sassy Assassin, but that is not why I'm here to talk to you today. I am here to tell you a story and to ask for your help. My best memories growing up are of my of spending time with my relatives during Christmas and the other holidays. Um, just being near them, listening to their stories, swapping presents, uh, playing games, in particular, in particular playing poker after dinner. The kids weren't allowed to play, but we could help with the betting. And, uh, and I always treasured the times I spent with these amazing hip cats. Uh, and they became role models of who I wanted to be when I grew up. Uh, adventurous and generous and kind and wise and hilarious. And um, and so I've always had a soft spot in my heart for older people. I love to go to concerts with them, whether it's Dixieland or Tuba Christmas. I love to go to aqua aerobics with them. Those are the my favorite classes, hanging out with the ladies. I love to go to lunch with them, drink cocktails with them, dance with them, listen to them, and flirt with them, and just make them feel special, which is why I've been really bothered over the last couple months of some of the behavior I've seen that is not so nice and respectful to seniors. And, um, and it makes me very sad. I've seen people honking when seniors are, when people are driving and they're not leaving right when the light turns green, uh, yelling at when we're driving a little bit slowly in the parking lot, getting impatient or not answering questions in the market and just saying, oh, hurrying along, I don't need to hear your story, you know, whatever, just not, just, it, it, and it makes me sad. So I want to do something about it. I want to raise awareness and show my personal support and, um, and respect for seniors. So I am launching Something Sweet for Seniors. It's, uh, it's a movement that I'm starting to prove that Silver is sweet and sassy. And what I hope to accomplish is to just share some great resources and, um, and some ways that you can help seniors too. It's the holiday season. There's a lot of people in need. And you can choose any different kinds, right? You can adopt pets or you can uh, adopt a family or you can give uh, your time and, your, and, and gifts to children. But, uh, but I'm choosing the seniors this year. And there's three ways that you can get involved in this movement. You can, the first one is to act, act differently. Be a little bit more patient and courteous and kind to seniors, a little bit more understanding and compassionate uh, when they're having a little bit of trouble getting around or, or really just want to say something, a story, or you know, share something that they know. And the second way is to give. So if you're short on time, uh, giving money or giving clothes or gifts or food to numerous organizations that are out there. And two in particular, one is through, that I got through Spectrum Gym, is uh, be a Santa for senior with Home Instead Senior Care. And you buy a gift and you uh, take it to Spectrum Gym and they match it up and they deliver it to the seniors. And you can, it's anything from t-shirts and playing cards to stationary sets and stamps. Uh, and the other one that I found so far is socks for seniors. So I got this in the Easy Reader, which is a fantastic paper, by the way, uh, in the November 24th issue. And they need socks and area coordinators for people to gather these for seniors and other people who need to keep their feet warm during winter. Uh, so that's two things that you can do. And then the third way is to actually help. So to go down and to help serve a meal at a Salvation Army or to, which they had one at, in Thanksgiving at the one down by King Harbor, or to deliver meals or gifts or just visit with seniors or deliver library books. I used to have a fantastic gal that I used to deliver library books to, and she was awesome. And those were, those were the best times I spent with her, just not even talking about the books, just talking about her adventures. Uh, so that's another way that you can do it. And in, 
In support of this, I'm going to be wearing a fabulous silver ribbon every day it, to show my support and uh, my participation in the Something Sweet for Seniors. Um, and I encourage you to do the same if you have any silver ribbon, and who doesn't around this time of year, right? To wear it, to show your support. Um, I will have silver ribbons with me in case you ever see me out and about looking fabulous in my silver. Uh, or if you want me to post you one in the mail, you can email me at kristen at therohands.com and I would love to share one of my silver ribbons with you. Um, I will also be blogging about this during the month at kristenrohan.com, sassy-silver-seniors, and I'll be sharing these resources so you don't have to rewind and write them all down because I'll have uh, these and any others so if you have any to share or you know of ways that we can help seniors please let me know and share them with me because I really think that we can make a difference and just show respect and uh, and our support for these people that have really I believe paved the, the way for us to be who we are today. Um, I want to thank you for listening and uh, I wish you the best holiday season. Remember silver is sweet and sassy um, and hope to see you out there with your silver on. Happy holidays and cheers.